this way since the recent troubles began. All right, guys, we're doing the video on Diablo 2. This is IT guy 89. Welcome to my channel. The Lord of Terror walks the world again. I don't know if I believe that, but a dumb. This uh game plays with the barbarian. Barbarian's a fun class. Um, I haven't played Diablo 2 in quite a long time. Um, Welcome, Outland. It was actually a great game to play. Uh, it's actually one of the first games I got I got introduced to as a kid. My brother played this game with me, and I think it was my first, one of my first PC games. Hello, uh, I am Akara. I played this in Fallout. Of the sisterhood of the sightless eye. You know, the storyline was great. Uh, there is a place of great that's why I learned more about potions and item stats. equipment. I, I think I learned a lot of that here. Questing and... Oh yeah. Man, this brings back some good memories. Fighting the bosses here. Like, some of these bosses are ridiculously hard. I mean, when I got to them points and... They started casting like you know. I think the you boss here in Act One does a does a ultimate cast. It's called Poison Nova, and it just like blasts you, and it's just like everyone dies immediately. It's like I mean, you don't even expect Beware it. I mean, so much stuff you guys don't expect. Beast. If you guys if you guys never played this game, it's definitely a, a must play a game. Um, It's basic, like, quick combat, so, you know, it's really user-friendly to new players. Um, just left-click, right-click right now, um, and then one through four keys to, like, use your potions and stuff. Um, you can just pick up gold and pick up items. Items just drop. Um, it, there's a lot of things that spawn around you, because, you know, you know how Diablo plays if you've played it before, it's just... It's about, it's a hack and slash game, it's like a, I just want to kill things and loot, you know, and, and listen to a good story, that, that's what you're into, Diablo 2 is definitely, um, something that you should think about, um, there's a leveling system inside of it, there's, there's a skill tree, there's, uh, I mean, there's shrines, Oh man, there's so much, there's so much into it. Um. <laughs> it was cool, right? <laughs> Right there, is the new stats just came up and just leveled up. You can uh, go into those stats, add stats. I'm gonna add stats, you know, like that. So, go into my skills, and you know, you got war cries there, you got combat masteries that you can learn. Uh, it's, you know, it's, it's, there's a lot of things that you can read about um, and learn about this game. Um, everything's optional there's no I don't think there's like a a specific way you should go it's like whatever you think is best for what whatever you want to do like whatever weapon you're gonna use and whatever armor you're gonna wear I mean I know you do need strength to wear heavier armor later in the game so if you want to invest in the strength that would be a good uh, good way to go um, there's little chests like that that you see right there and diamonds you can loot diamonds and there's a little cube where you put these diamonds together and then and then it creates like a better a better type of diamond uh, it's like an upgrading system um, we'll find that later on that's an it's a, it's a, it's a interesting aspect of the game um, one of my favorite things about this game is like the set armor like this there's armor that's like it's like a green when it falls on the floor and then when you like identify it because I don't think I find anything that's rare or of good quality yet but when you find good quality items it has like different colors Impossible. and there's like 
there's just like these green like items that uh that you identify and then they become like a set item and they're just so cool there's so many like mysterious sets in the game like you don't i don't know exactly how many there are but there's a good amount and they they give you extra attributes and extra skills and it just makes the gun game unique i think that's what makes the game unique uh yeah guys so like this is a uh, diablo 2 um lord of destruction and um i definitely recommend you guys play this game um I'm always gonna give this game probably a 10 out of 10. Um, no, no, it, it doesn't get boring. It doesn't even uh, even if the graphics. I know you're probably looking at the graphics right now. You're like, what? There's like way better game, better to play. And just just try it. Don't knock it until you try it. Um, it's okay to go retro sometimes, guys. Because um, retro brings back memories. Retro brings back good times, and and even still gives you. Like the lightning I'm doing, so uh, I think I'm gonna cut the video right here. I think it's a good intro so far, so you can see what's going on. And I, I guys hope you, uh, I hope you like the video, and I hope you guys actually uh, get into Diablo 2 and get some uh, gameplay.